Okay, hello guys and welcome back to my channel. It's Nekolab Gaming here. Back today, second episode uh, of, uh, well, what technically speaking was supposed to be Wednesday, but these are getting uploaded late into the night, uh, morning of two of Thursday. Anywho, we're back and from last, last episode we left off, we are soon at the, done with the project assembly. So we need two more. There goes that one. Then we have one last one. There we go. It means I'm also gonna kill these belts. Let this continue with its own stuff. So that means we should now be ready. Oh yay! That means now we have access to C and four, which means we can get Koya power. <laughs> which we're actually not far away from actually managing to do. We're gathering rotors and stuff. But one thing we need to also take into the account is basic steel production, but that's gonna require modular frames I think I wanna get coal power first and while all of that is pretty much automatic um, I can make it even faster really well I can make the uh, iron plate side of things faster. That's gonna make 10 per minute. 120 per minute and 60 per minute. This one is creating 100 per minute. Uh... Which means, yes, we're already short on screws, we... Oh, I think we're fine on plates, though. Use uh, 60 plates per minute, and we have two on it, so... 30, 30, 60. Oh, so that's Gucci! Although, we already have, like, 150 plates, so... Or 105, so... We won't have to sit there for too long before we have what we need. Well, there is all the plates we need. Now we can slow down that one again. There we go. You need 300 wire though. Or 300 cable. But... Constructors need two plates, blah blah blah. Well, we only need one. A bone smelter. Oh no, actually, we do need two. Because we need one to s one to make the wire. So for now, I'm just gonna put um, my little uh, uh, Now, I have a feeling... I 
Oh, I dis... I disabled it. Oh god. Can't walk in type. Can't type man. We now why is this one dead? Oh wait a minute. Eh? New power? Oh yeah. Yeah. Now I'm out of Caterium Wire. Everything I'm running out of now. Well, I have lots of Caterium on me, so that's... Yes. Faster car indeed. But now at least we'll maybe be able to get some copper. I'll put an MK or well, really we do not need... Like it puts out 60 per minute, so in ground and the reason I think it's actually enough with an MK1 belt. Uh, that's the wrong Google tab. Yes, Mark 1 can take. Well, but do you know what we do then? That one is obviously full. So... <laughs> one! There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're cutting our clothes. Let's see if it's long till the copper arrives. Uh, no, not at all. The moment I exited the door, here the copper is. So now if just there we go. The quality wants to update. Takes 30 a minute. These ones can do 60 per minute. Which means we should be good. So this would make us all the copper we need. This one has already made all the rotors we need. So boom, now we only need the wires and we're off to the races.
Okay, folks, we back. And we got coal power. Milestone reached. Coal is an improved alternative power source to biomass and can be fully automated if provided water with the new pipeline buildings and power throughout the initial setup. Well, I'm pretty much fully automated. In biomass too, but okay. Note. Ensure the close proximity of water to the coal production line. Note, pumps will aid in vertical transport of... Yeah, yeah. So, now we have... Oh, God. Our coal generator. And I also now have my... Um, six. My pipelines. Now, the plan is to have it up here because there isn't water source. Not too far from this one. Oh, well, there is some water here. I guess the biggest pond ever. I mean, that is the closest pond we have. But no, actually not. We do have a pond not far from here. That I can run water to. Um... So, there's these. Yeah, I'll propose water. Yeah, we have a pretty gigantic pond we can pull from. I guess I can just add a... Maybe we want to do something down in here. On the beach. But yes, this is going to be where we were getting water. So let me know that. But I need to make copper sheeting. Before I can put up a lot of pipes. I also need the... Uh, rotors for the water extractors. Well, here's the thing. We we got cool. Yeah. Woo. Well, I just need to pump out some water extractors. There we go. My alt key had hung up. Now they're gonna have to pull that, uh... <laughs> we're gonna have to pull the coal quite the way, but... We'll get it up here. Eventually. Although now. The 50 frames. That and the rods.
If I split this one now. Oh. I don't know how I have one modular frame already, but okay. Three per minute, twelve per minute. This one produces five per minute. That's probably six per minute, ain't it? Four point five, actually. Although we do got the travel distance as well, so it not being exactly 5 is actually working out in our favor. We're creating 3 per minute. So if we need 50... That's gonna be... Yes. 16 minutes. Well, I'm gonna take and uh, let that thing work and I'll be back with you soon. Okay, we're back. I'll restart later. I think I also figured out why I was having so much issues with the auto truck yesterday because my graphics drivers has updates, but sure, that's besides the point. Anywho, we got 50 modular frames. We There are 50 frames. There is the 300 concrete. And holy fuck. Like wire or something. And I'm gonna stop. This one. So that way I can like get shit like yoink. Now. Uh, there's a hundred rotars. Right there. Uh, so those go into there. We got some more of those to go on. We got the wires. That needs to be made. Which is going to take a half minute. So yeah. We'll be back once that's on the roll again. Okay. So we are back. After a... Um, Quick display driver install or update. Yeah. 
Yes. Oh, well, are we out of biomass? I. Um. Yikes. Um. All right. Give me a. Um, give me a half minute. Okay. So I fixed our power situation because our power broke. And, um. Yes. So I'll be BRB once we got more copper wire. Okay, so after watching like two YouTube videos, uh, one random YouTube video that I do not remember, a few TikToks, and one Best of Me Sojo um, clip. Oh yeah, boy, in we have wire, and I'm gonna put you back to copper wheat. Oh boy. Oh, well, anywho. I'm still in production! Milestone reached. Steel production. Now! Where do I put this temper in? <laughs> Here, I guess? Although I need 10 frames to do that. Which fits perfectly because that one's done. Now then power. And then... Well, ceiling good. We already got coal. But now we need clean iron ore. But now we got steel! So... Huh. I guess I'll just, uh... Do that for the coal, I guess? But now as we got steel... Well, the pot is still launched, but... Still... Yes. Ah, oh, yes, I forgot about that. We can actually do modular power if we want to. If you want to do advanced stuff. I forgot about that, actually. 
Well, that one we can do without the steel. Oh, is it tier 4? Is this? Yes. Boom. Now I need to borrow a constructor. For now making steel beams. I'm gonna need to get more coal. Oh, didn't I have an extra? Yes, I did. I got two. Oh, there goes my Spotify. Honkity tonk again. We're soon there. We. Where's even that other one being used at the moment in here? Forty-five per minute. This one uses ninety per minute, so I guess in ground and reason is this thing we should speed up. Okay, we're back, and we have now swapped out all the belts in our factory. And... Well... Boom. Boom. We need cable, though, but we do got wire. No, we do not. Um, excuse me? Oh. And a little while later, we're back. I've now wired up the iron ore to go down here. So now we got 150 plus 120. Being delivered, so that's a total of, um, um, two hundred and seventy. So that's exactly the limitations of this belt, which means we're pulling as much in on this belt as we can at the moment. And that means that none of our machines in here should be backlogged. Plus, we should have enough iron to also keep, um, our foundries going. We we'll probably need to set up more foundries sooner or later, and then I can just use those two impure nodes and pull some from them. There is like no pure iron nodes close by. So, what we've done so far, uh, I'll probably make this a separate episode from the other episode because of how long it is. What we've done so far is that we have, uh, well, gotten our stuff going. I picked out all the rotors that was in here, right? Uh, not in there. In here, yes I did. 45 per minute. That means it will take us about four minutes, five minutes ish. So that's the copper line. I know we need at least two, two, four for Katerium later down the line. I need at least two for Quartz. So, yeah. <laughs> Rather said, we need a lot. Oh, well, that wind turbine ain't gonna be very effective once this building gets higher.
Yeah, since we're only splitting it up on two smelters, it should be fine. Do 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 no. Bam ba da ba. Boom. Boom. And perfect. Um, question mark? There we go. Get the area main good. And then over here will be our clutch corner. Now, the lights we're gonna wire directly up to the main power of the entire building and not on the switch because we always want the lights to work, so... That's our quartz. Now... Well, I think now is a perfect time to turn this shit on. Woo! Okay! Well, power situation changed. We're only using about 19 at the moment, which is very weird. Or maybe not. Because everything down here is literally full. Maybe why? I have so many plates on me, it's ridiculous. A little more power consumption here now, yes. We're laying fine on power so far. Well, I've been recording for two hours in this episode, so I think that's going to be enough for today's episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. <clears throat> Remember to check out links down below. Uh, other than that, like, subscribe, all of that. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned and stay awesome. Necolive Gaming out.